All right, about 7.30 in the morning on Sunday, 26 February. Uh, I mentioned in my other video I was going to discuss some more safety enhancements to this EG4 Life Power 4.6 gun battery server rack system. Uh, but first, I just want to show you, I've had a couple of days to monitor this system, and so far so good. I'm pretty impressed. Um, numbers don't lie with this uh, included software, but the voltages are staying in balance, about three one hundredths of a volt from what I can see. Sated charges are good, so good job. And I did run them down to about 22% state of charge one day and did some math. And yeah, they're, it's going to probably put out 30 kilowatt hours all day. So it's running solid. Came up, fired up. All right, let's get to the safety stuff before I make this a 10 minute freaking video. Um, first thing I want to show you is with the bus bars that they sent me and why these are, you don't want to do this at all. Bad, bad, bad. So there's a four rot lug mounted to the this bus bar. See that gap right there? See the rib nut insert there? Bad. So what I had to do is I just had to drill, take this rib nut insert out, and just put a freaking bolt in there and tighten it down hard. And these are the smaller ones that go to the batteries. And all I did with these is just drill a quarter inch hole. And bolt them to the bus bar and I'll show you right down here a little bit and yeah, maybe not let's talk a little bit here I'll show you what I did with the top see I had to buy these PVC cable raceways myself and I like them I like them I like them I like them but the one <laughs> they're just about an inch off and, on, and I had some exposed copper on the end up here and I got into my parts bin and I found these guys I mean you can buy these for like 11 bucks for a four pack two red two black and I just slit down the middle and covered this guy up right here and problem solved and I could probably just back off this top isolator screw and slide it down there permanently but as you can see there's some of my work with the bolts there the other thing I did too is right here Oh, yes, there's 600 amps potential. So that goes right right up there, and it looks really, really slick. All right, and the last thing I want to show you is this is heavy 4 ot welding cable rated. See how it kind of dangles right there? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use these guys. These are automotive, boat, marine style. Clamp on here, drill a hole in the top of the cabinet, and just mount them right up there for the for the positive and for the negative down there for cable relief and safety and there you have it I don't feel like talking anymore on Sunday so I told you I'd do some more safety enhancements see the new table put a new table in and we'll be working on painting the back wall here got a little accessory panel down here I made with a real cigarette lighter, 12 volt power socket. You can light your smoky treat with that. And there you have it. Thanks for watching. As always, do things safely. And we'll see you next time.